Secretary for Foreign Affairs, Enrique Manado, and then Secretary of Defense, Marks, after which we will have the Q&A. Secretary, Secretary Manalo, please. Both of us share concerns, uh, and many other countries in the region share concerns as well, about some of the actions that the People's Republic of China has taken, escalatory actions in the South China Sea, the East China Sea, and elsewhere. And this is something that we heard uh, much about from our colleagues at the recent ASEAN meetings. Defiance of the 2016 Arbitral Tribunal decision, uh, coercive methods being used in, uh, in the seas. Today, as you heard, Secretary Blinken and I announced that we are poised to deliver a once-in-a-generation investment to help modernize the armed forces of the Philippines and the Philippine Coast Guard. We're working with the U.S. Congress to allocate $500 million in foreign military financing into the Philippines. Now, this level of funding is unprecedented and it sends a clear message of support for the Philippines from the Biden-Harris administration, the U.S. Congress, and the American people.